So today I just wanted to talk about some of the challenges that I'm having doing this vlog. First challenge is time. It's having a full-time job and then trying to vlog. It's 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 hard, man. It's really hard to stay consistent. And I guess the second would be the same as the first. That's being consistent. That's all you have to do is really stay consistent at what you want to do. So this vlog is just telling you a little bit about why it's so hard. From the beginning of the day, you have to you know, get ready for work, you go to work, you come home, and you're tired. You really don't want to do anything. So if you really want to do this, if you really want to do anything, you'll put your heart and soul into it, right? I really want to do this, but I have to work on myself as a person to be more enthusiastic about what I love to do. I absolutely love video editing. I don't have the time to create the content that I would really like, but as you can see over time, the videos will get better and better on this on this channel. It's just completely staying focused on the project at hand. So I'm a full-time job, I do the, basically the same thing. I edit videos, I create uh, content, advertising content, uh, create campaigns to generate money for an institution, right? So then when I come home, I, I have very to little energy left to put into my own uh, projects, which would be this YouTube. It has to do with self-discipline. So what I'm gonna do for the self-discipline is to go ahead and do these vlogs, come up with some kind of content that I can actually push out and put on there. Quality content that is personable, that talks about same things that other people may have problems with doing the same thing that I'm doing with. So second or thirdly I think wait one time two one time two was consistent cons one was time two was consistency so three I guess would be so I guess I'm gonna have to get up earlier because there's other things that I would like to do that I have to do uh, personally to make this work better is to have more energy and to have more energy I'm gonna have to lose weight look at some of the videos man I look like I drink a keg of beer a day and I don't I just have a very inactive job position I sit at a desk all day and then I come home and I do these videos and I sit at a desk again so I'm gonna have to get up extra early to get some kind of exercise in this will help with self-control this will help with energy and I have to adjust my time time management is not good for me personally uh, time flies. You see, those of you who are creators who uh, create music, who go into a studio, those who sit at the desk and make graphic design, you know that when you sit and you get in that zone, time goes by like it was just light outside. It's now two in the morning. I got to get up in four hours. So there's all kinds of things that happen to us. Time management is a very important process of the creative process and those of us who don't have it like me uh, really have to work on it so I'm gonna have to work on my time management my consistency uh, my energy level all of this so I have to come up with a plan and stick to that plan so the first thing that I'm gonna do to execute this plan is get up early and walk at least three to four miles eat a good breakfast which I never do I drink my breakfast coffee 24 ounces with cream and sugar so I'm gonna have to supplement that with something else some type of tea uh, or something else so I can get my day started correctly skipping breakfast is definitely not a good thing so I've been told so good breakfast morning exercise get ready for work go to work come home and then start to create the content that I really like to create my own content this is the content that I create throughout the eight-hour day is that of somebody else's and it makes somebody else a lot of money so wish me luck keep me accountable ask me make sure you subscribe below 
ask me how I'm doing, make sure I stay on track. For those of you who don't really care, could care less, say something anyways, like uh, to motivate me, like your videos suck, or your channel sucks, or your content is horrendous. Do something, just motivate me. If you can't do anything positive, do something negative or work in a positive way for me, at least. Because I love it when somebody tells me something's terrible or I can't do it. So, thank you for listening. That was my vlog for the day. Remember, always be creative. Peace.